Okay friends, today we're going to get started making a hot dog with warm colors. I'm going to start by writing my name at the top of my page. After we put our name on our paper, then we're going to get started drawing our dog on this side of our paper. In the middle, I'm going to draw two dots for eyes. Then, I'm going to draw a circle around those eyes. Now my dog has two eyes and it needs a nose. So underneath these eyes, I'm going to draw a little nose. If you want, you can even color that nose in. Now I'm going to draw my dog's mouth. So I'm going to come down and make a J shape. Then I'm going to do the same thing on the other side, but backwards. So I'll do a backwards J shape. Now I'm going to give my dog a little smile down here. Next thing I'm going to do is draw my dog's head. So I'm going to start here and go up and around. I'm going to go up and around to connect my dog's head. Now my dog needs some ears. So I'm just going to draw some little triangle shapes here. If you want your dog to have pointy ears, he can have pointy ears. Or floppy ears like this. Or you could even do both. That's up to you. So give your doggy some ears. And then we're going to give our dog a body. So I'm going to draw a line down. Then I'm going to draw a curved line over here. Then I'm going to draw a line to connect these. I'm going to give my dog some big paws. It's just half a circle and half a circle. And then finally, I'm going to give my dog a tail. So now I have a little dog. This is going to be a hot dog, which means I'm going to use warm colors like orange, red, yellow, and even pink. When I color, what I'm going to do is just draw some lines to look like the dog's fur. If you want to add some spots, you can even add some spots. But really just focus on lines to give your dog a lot of texture. To make him look like he's a really furry dog. Now that I've colored some fur on my dog, here comes the fun part. I'm going to get some water and my paintbrush. And I'm going to paint over my lines. And my marker is going to start to turn into a little bit of paint. And I'm just going to blend all those colors together. And if I go outside the lines a little bit, that is a-okay. And there you have it my finished hot dog. 